the and they're the ones missing out. With us. They're the ones really missing out. They're the ones who aren't rich. They're not rich. Hey, Chad. We're rich. You can't see him, Mama. We're Mama, rich in each other. Back. Huh? I just brought Chad into the chat, Amy. Oh. Can we hear each other? I can hear you. You hear me all right? Beauty. Sweet. Yay! Yeah, man. Are you playing on screen? Yeah, he's on screen. Yes, sir. Yeah, I feel like, uh, you know, if people can, like, uh, collectively at least hold a moment in their mind that is a good place to move forward from, and everybody tries to fucking do that thing from that space, we could do something. You know what I mean? Maybe this time when the wave fucking crests, it'll be a little bit better. It'll be a little bit higher. It'll be, it'll fucking meet the land where we need it to or whatever, whatever the circumstance is. I just feel like, uh, you know, the more, the more I'm out here at sea fucking <laughs> talking to these people like you, Chad, and like other people, I feel like we're all kind of adrift and we're all looking for something that's going to fucking hold us together and, you know, keep us on the positive course Yeah. for our children, for the fucking future. You know what I mean? To keep thinking positive. And, uh, I hope that's what we're, what we're doing right now. Cause, uh, I fucking love it. If it is. I feel like we're coming together, that our people are coming together, that it's been happening for a long time. Yeah. It's, it seems like it's coalescing more and more. You know, and I, I, I think the big thing, um, you know, the, the music and art has to really reflect the kind of world that we, that, that we need, that we want to see. Um, it's, it's such a powerful tool and it's why, you know, they, they, they purposely, uh, it, you know, reward certain types of, uh, of, um, of music or whatnot. That's why. I think yeah. Are certain cool. images and certain ideology or whatever, just like certain fixtures that are in place. And, that, and, that, and that's, that's not to take, take away because, you know, being in, in the industry, you know, you still have people that are in the industry, you know, they're, sure. they're, it's not, they don't, people don't see the landscape of how it's being the social engineering. They're, they don't see what's going on. They're just participating in the system and, and the reward system, you know, it's like, Oh, you meet a president, you know, that's, that's, that's so cool. You know what I mean? Like right. that's, that's yeah. kind of, they, that's your reward. Yeah. And, and it, the, people don't really understand the depth and what actions, the behavior, what they have done, and how many people's lives have been destroyed because of these people that, you know, have no problem lying. Right. And, and, and what, that it's completely not, not what's going on. You know what I mean? Because exactly these like, models, oh. these models are, are, are completely put in place for people to just stay within those, those realms so that stuff doesn't get messed up, you know what I mean? Like people can progress and and and, and aspire and ascent and descend and whatever in whatever you know your reality that they're in. Your reverb is still on. Is, is it? Dingo is saying. God damn it! <laughs> Thank you, Dingo. We, we, you know, part Sonic of it too check, is, is if you do speak out or if you do something, then you know they they really send the. Uh, to send people after you in a way. So there's a safe space a, yes. that people, people kind of stay in because mm -hmm. they don't want the wrath. You know, Certainly. So, and, and this is how I make, I make the argument because, you know, and, and we could talk about the whole Colin Kaepernick. It's, it's a good example, right? Because I, I mm -hmm. think, I, you know, my view on that issue has changed, but it's, it, it's the same, again, the same principle of, right. of how, how they used a, a and this because what Jay Z had said, and it, this sticks with me because he had said, "Oh, it's not about the job; it's not about the job," and dismissing it, and how how this uh, and it wasn't about the job; it was about 
the retaliation is, is about okay if you speak up if you use this thing this is what's going to happen to you right this is, this is a message not necessarily to the people but to the other players hey your career is done yeah and, and that was that was what was so disheartening for me to see uh, about that situation because now I, looking back and you look the fourth of july right look at the flags everywhere how can yeah. you blame somebody yeah. for for their you know what they their experience right because it's about a party it's about this right so they've got all this emotional attachment which is what they do right of that's course the whole thing about the, that's how it's built the, the national <laughs> yeah. anthem so yeah. Yep. The way it was framed was demonizing people for having that knee jerk reaction of the emotional response when right. that's not right. It's like you have to give people the opportunity to feel that because that that's what the protest was about. Right. And, and I, I participated in that in that whole thing, like, you know, but it sure. wasn't so, you know, really seeing Kaepernick take the money from Nike that the whole thing just it, it just it's like it, it, it yeah. doesn't matter at some point you're still kissing the ass of the establishment at some point. No matter what you do, you're, you're still, you're still right there where you were at the, at the end of the day. Yeah. If, if you're really principled, yes. then, then there's got, it, it's about the, see, for me, it's about the conversation. It's, the, it's we're not having the right conversations. Yeah, dude. I, 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 I agree I with that, Chris. <laughs> Chad, I, 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 it's, <laughs> see what, go ahead. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I totally agree with what you're saying. Like, it's not the right, we're not having the right talk. You know what I mean? We could have, a, we could have a really fucking, you know, developed conversation about all of these things that you just were talking about and implying, you know what I mean? And all their fucking repercussions and all of those things, but we're not doing any of that. We're just like, we are stereotyping the fucking mindset and we are just powering forward. And that's, that's the fucking goal every it every 4th of July, it. every fucking everything forever. Well, and what it strips what it of I, what it actually is. Yeah. It, it, it what identity, politics, identity politics does. It creates this the same attitude as as th those uh, the, the Pentecostal preacher kind of kind of Bible bash that, that and I'm talking yeah. about the character of it. You know, right. I'm not talking about because I, I grew up in the church, the, the Pentecostal church got a prophecy. My grandpa, grandma, right. my dad's a preacher, you know, like everybody's a pastor, preacher. Right you know, on. And so it's I went through this this thing where I, I had my issues and, and I went at it. But I, I, I you still have to remember where where people's heads are. You know, it's just where they are. Yeah. Right. And, yeah. And it, and there and there's a balance and, and it's and it's it's crazy because with, with everything that, the way that everything's went is yeah. that the people that christians would i guess because the way that people categorize them would be on the right because it's a blanket sure. right sure um, it's just it, blanket um is that there's more in common because you see what's going on and, and and there's more of a connection because you 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 can call out what's going on with the democratic party and see how it how how it funnels and that's that to me is is a bonding part that that I, I i'm able to see okay well people are being gaslit i'm being yeah. gaslit I, yeah you know i didn't realize how much trump derangement syndrome i had like seeing right. some yes yes oh, dude we oh, did too. oh my god I, last I year I, dude Fuck yeah. Hard. Well, not it's last hard. year, but when COVID started. Oh, yeah. When COVID oh. started, mostly we just mainly just dementia. Just like, like we thought we were MSM like aware of inflicted shit. dementia. <laughs> we weren't aware of anything. Like, like are you it. fucking kidding me? We didn't know any of the things. We didn't know any of the actual dangers that were presented to us because we were just inundated with fear 24 7. You know, then, every second of the day. And like, then now oh, I look every back. Every feed that you had coming at you was like some kind of Trump said this or did, 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 and bu, 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 and just this constant clip. inundation of. I'll hear a clip or see uh, something on Trump and I'm like, wow, board. like he really did make a lot of sense. He did. In that, even he said a lot of things asshole. that made sense. Well, but after it, the fact, that, everybody's just like, but that's a, wait, 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 that, that doesn't is. make that doesn't make me a Trump supporter. It just no. makes me realize that at the time, how delusional it was. Yeah. Uh, like how how the narrative that we 
felt like believe. I had, well, you know what? You know, they, I, I had fed into it myself. Like, fuck, man, they got me. Sorry. Like, you know, and I'm thinking that ahead, I'm Jared. aware of everything, <laughs> and I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah. So I get what you're saying when you're like, when you're like, you know, it, you're. What? It's a it's lot. Why, <laughs> it's it's a why lot. they're doing it. See, I yeah. always thought Trump was the patsy. I always thought Trump was in on it from the beginning, and the whole idea was okay. Let's let's the 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 clock a broken clock's right twice a day. So yeah. let's have all these main issues. Like, of course, you talk about the FISA warrant. You talk about the Russia Gate. You talk about <laughs> the, like they said, the legal spine. There's certain things, the, the bullshit impeachment thing. There's certain yep. things that gave validity to yes. the argument that built his base. Yes, you, you see what I'm saying. So, yes, it solidified and, his lower base of people like standing steadfast with him. But so all but this bullshit idea, was fed for the that. The idea was to paint to paint these certain issues, like because remember it's a blanket. So you you say okay, well, yeah, they they tell you okay, well if if somebody has this position, they're right wing automatically. Yeah. So that was the whole thing. That's the whole thing about about a fox news versus cnn whatever yes. the idea is you you put it on fox news you have it was whatever to yeah. put the left asleep that's, exactly that, that's the game and, whatever and this spin is it's going to put the left asleep and put the right all up pissed off about something and then when yeah. someone's telling the truth we were played we then, were all yeah. played when really well telling the truth then then what happens is is you're you too busy having to defend them it's like again if, if Trump's saying the Clinton's crooked and corrupt, that's the truth. Like, right. you, you, why would you, why would anybody try and deny that to one of his supporters? Like, right. Because you're, and what you're doing is you're build, you're building the base, you're building the fire. The, the best way to take, take, first of all, steam is to acknowledge where, where the truth lies. Yeah. And, you know, and then acknowledge where there's the fire. Well, but yeah. acknowledge how the propaganda got to where it got. You have we have mm -hmm. to reverse engineer things to a point to where we're not yeah. emotional about it. Because yeah. that's you have to relearn the everything and look at it. It's from more. A new it's more. It's more about like understanding things from what you just said. Like understanding okay. things are manipulated in a way for you to feel a certain way about viewing it, them. And, and the left at the all left times is is the emotional. And, and, and I, the, the left is the emotional. Uh, they're the ones that get, go emotional and they're easy yeah, they're, to manipulate. They're off the emotional. sad Look, sacks. Yes. And, and I hate to say it, but I mean, all the stuff with Epstein, all these different things. And, and then it, it's the abortion thing. You know, this, the, yeah. they, they, they bring this out. This is planned. This, the whole point was to create the problem in order to, to, to be able to fix it. So it's like, yes, it, the, the point is, 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 you can't change these things unless you get the corruption out. But the, right. that, the problem is, is we ignore the same behavior on our own team exactly. just to be against that behavior on the other team. It's, so it's like, it's like we're playing the same game. It's football. You know, you yeah, so now it's, we're, we're it's, in it's fucking weird... flag football all day. So yes. now I feel like we're in this weird, like ob observer kind of like status. It is a weird paradigm. We are because hang on. <laughs> Cause we're not like, in the no, Trump derangement the same thing that or you're saying. on the left, it's like, we're kind of like observers of this going, yeah. whoa, we can see the whole picture. It's like a bigger and paradigm the whole thing. And you know? everyone's ignoring this bigger picture because they're in the globe fighting. And we're like looking at it going, oh shit. Oh shit. We're seeing the puppet strings. We can see what's happening. Yeah. And it puts us into this weird niche. Like we're in this weird. It's like, a weird observer area. kind of role of what, what, like you're watching. Well, democracy fail before you, look, and fucking look just at, all these things crumble. All these rights just go away. Look at Cap. You know? So look at Kaepernick. What the fuck? So what What were people arguing about Kaepernick? One was why they were protesting. Yeah, and the and the other was how they were protesting. So you yep. have two people arguing two different you're never you, you're, you, and, you can and never meet those how, guys yes so you have to concede that how they were protesting yeah. there, there's a, an emotional response that was designed and it, yes. you can't take that away from someone regardless of if you agree with someone or not you right. have to acknowledge the emotional the, the human emotion that yeah. is, is is designed 
and and that's- I think I think it's apparent. It's apparent if you if you like actually pan back, and like you know what I mean when people do like drone footages of things like like uh, like campaign trails and things like that and stuff where people are moving and moving and doing these things, all of these things to make this one all thing these, happen. Like, you could see are all the fucking moving parts actually manifesting this thing before your fucking eyes. If you can see far enough into the future of the frames, you know what I mean? It's just like, it's madness, but it's, it's absolutely what is happening in real time. Like everybody is just like manipulating those factors to meet their ends. Well, it's, it's Hollywood. Until they're found out different or whatever. You know what I mean? Well, it like just keeps going. Think about this. So Instagram, right? Everybody kind of jokes about, you know, people faking the lie, faking the funk, you know, and, and you've seen, yeah. you probably seen those things where they take a toilet seat and act like they're on a plane and different things like that. You know what I mean? Like it's all about sure. angles and pictures. Well, it, uh, people need to understand and take that model and say, what do you think the media is? And what do you think the media has been doing? This, <laughs> right. this, is, this is influence. If you look at it, so look at, look, if you look at the Instagram models, and, and this is something we're, we're still young in social media, which I, I believe is, is the key. It's not, I don't think it's in the streets. It's, it's in here. Because yeah. once we say, okay, we're, we're, we're going to figure out a way to, right. to make sure these people. As soon as have, everybody have gets on it. Accountability. As soon it's as everybody like, uploads that motherfucker, uh, we're on right. it. Yes. Yeah. Um, oh, shit. I lost yeah. my train of thought. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. No, 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 no. I, I got all motivated. Like, yes, yes, yes. No, That's no, the no, thing. I That's the thing. I think it's all the connections <laughs> coming together. And it then is, doing man. something on social media. It's yeah. Fucking <laughs> synopsis crossing, bro. Well, yeah, I, I, I just started. I started seeing. Yeah, you think so, Peaches? Oh, because oh, so it was. It was a network. So how everybody kind of likes. Oh, oh, Instagram models. This is the best way. Best way to do it. So, since we're young in the internet age, I've been. I've watched how it works. So you have all these models, and there's different tiers, right? They would, when they would do shoots together, they take pictures and tag each other and share things and whatnot. So it creates this model of uh, of of views and, and tagging so every time yeah. if you got one of the girls you're going to see these other girls all the time and then eventually you'll probably add them or whatnot so this sure. there's this a marketing thing so it's the same way that you're seeing yeah it's not with, as the organic as people think it yeah is. it's not nearly as organic well, I, 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 no it, it, again it's these people know how to how to it's it's art direction and it, it's branding they're they're creating it's fucking a, curating a, from the from the get it's it's amazing yeah. So we can use that same thing, I think, is what you're getting at. That, right? that is the thing that's going to bring us together is that curation, that that the idea that we could all be on that same like, fucking thought process. We need to keep things. For I these, feel like we need to keep things small and tell they're not small. Yeah, but like and like to when, have when that we positivity there, that's constantly that you feel when you talk to another person, like like Chad, for instance. If you feel like, you know what I mean? When you talk to him, he makes you feel a certain way. And he has like these certain insights and these certain ideas that are fucking that resonate with you. So we need more of that. We need to, we need to foster that. We need to fucking make people understand what it is, the thing that it is you're trying to understand about that thing and fucking get more people involved uh, in more than just a topical way which is like well, super I, easy and marketable. Like he's, he's showing us like we can well, do well, this with music. I, and I feel like there's like ideas. We have all these like connections, like, like you have been on like uh primo radical and I, you know, like he has connections to other people and we just need to get all of us on the same thing. Well, all at so, the same time. So, and imagine so, what we could do and what information we could spread out there among this that's, web. That's that's the rub. That's the rub, though. Is it's it's hard to get people on the same board is because is people don't want to acknowledge the blind spots that they may have. Oh my and, gosh, I know, I know. That, <laughs> and that and that is is a hard thing to get to to people to understand is criticizing, critiquing, calling each other out within your own circle. Yes, we need to find a better way to do it, but these are these are serious things. Like if, if you're still pushing Bernie Sanders, 
you 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 miss the assignment. You don't know the assignment. You, exactly. You, yeah, you, we're if past you're, if that. You're, like, if you're if you're on on Dead and Company tour right now and you're screaming "Vote harder," you fucking miss the boat. Well, okay, but, yeah. Like that's but, just how I feel. But the thing at is, this point is we can't. A lot of times, it, it, it's not about saying, "Okay, you're not allowed to, to be involved. You're not you're not welcome here." But the yeah, thing no. is, we we we're, we don't need to. We need to make sure that the 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 baseline is that of what's going you on. You gotta catch up. You gotta catch up to uh, us. Because because that's that's the key part. Up. If people don't know the power structure and who's the gatekeeper and who's the one that's really influencing, that's where it goes back to the Instagram. You sure. have to understand who influences because if you see, okay, if this person, it, it's a power structure, and then that's yeah. why the establishment needs to get their face with different commentators to, with different people because what it does is it says, okay, well this person. Feels like I feel, but they're okay with Marianne Williamson, or they're okay with, with right. whatever. They're not, and it's again, it's not about Just the person. It's, it's about, fine. Just move along. And, and, and I know it. it's really hard. Yes, it's really hard. I and totally see that, man. It's a violence that we're, that is, we're finding ourselves. Okay, Peaches, chill. To me, that's like one of the finest ways that they can just separate yeah. people who are otherwise really like-minded. You know what I mean? In art and performance and all of the other things that so, surround music or whatever, right? So, like, if you have an idea that it's popular and it's a protest thing, then that's that's cool now. But like, we I, have I don't to... understand how that got to be fucking cool. That was never fucking cool. That wasn't cool when Woody Guthrie was fucking calling people out on it. Okay, well, here, I think what we need to do is find the thing. The one thing that we can all agree upon. Yeah. And, well, I know. I don't need to exclude however, everybody else however for we, the sake of I, that. I know, but however we get there, but we have to agree on one thing. Like we, There has to be a goal, a single thing that we all agree and unite upon. All right. So uh, we have to find that. And we I, have to I find Chad Wilson ground. has the coolest sunglasses on this uh, broadcast. I don't care what uh, anybody says. Yes. I have a suggestion. For that. <laughs> this, this is what I, if, if the day, the day people march to release Epstein client's name, you know, because remember it, it's, it's about who Ooh, these people yeah. implicate. It's about this power structure, but here's, here's the other thing too. The vacuum is we're not prepared. We're not ready. We're not, we're not at all mentally capable of, 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 because they don't want that because if they, if we had that, if they taught us that, then there would be no need for them and to exploit and all this yada, yada, yada. Because again, it's right. It, it, it's about families. You know, they pass it on to their kids, to their kids. Yeah, this, dude. This, it's like somebody it, accidentally seeing something at a funeral. Some, well, we don't talk about that. You know what I mean? I was just like, don't worry about that. It's like there's things like in politically that just happen in this country. Like, well, you, well, you just don't talk about that. You know, just forget it. Don't even worry about like that. you're supposed to like just put your blinders on for certain like, yeah, things. Yeah, you and know, certain we people. were we were really racist, then we created the crime bill and there's all of no, that, and you know no, everybody went to jail, and all the black families are ruined forever. Amen. But you know, Joe Biden, vote vote for Joe because he. My thing is, is that we just we need we need honesty and we need truth, and the way that we're gonna like I I have a. Um, a thing I always say is make peace with truth. Like the way that we are going to get peace is by being honest and by being truthful and stopping all the bullshit and shutting that ego and finally saying, okay, as a human, I value our humanity as a collective, as a whole more than feeling like I won this argument. You know, or, or, or I'm, you know, better than this person because of that or this, like fucking just stop the bullshit. Like people aren't. Yeah. We have to find the thing. We have to find that one common ground that we can agree with everybody on. Yeah. And and I I think it's corruption, but the thing is, again, is people don't know what corruption looks like in their own, in their own camp. 
Right. They don't know what it looks like. They don't know it. They don't understand how to connect the behavior. The cognitive it's a cinematic dis- thing that's uh, presented to them, uh, like corruption. Oh, that's like when detectives <laughs> are doing know. bad stuff. And what are you know what I mean? Okay, like there's no there's fight. no substantial we we like can't argue amongst each other. Process. We can't fight each other. We can't fight. We're, we're, we're we got to fight them. Look, that's what they want. This is all drama. Yeah. It's all personal. And people like no, this is what we fucking represent. <laughs> How right. how can a team go out there and say, okay, well, we can't we can't practice and, and get better at what we're doing? We, we, that's the whole thing, and we're not we're not doing that because there's 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 not a system, and there's right. not somebody that that has the uh, that's, that's really doing that. You know, that, that's really like, hard. There's no oversight. There's, there's no, no coordination. There's no coordination. The people, like it's like everybody is like running erratically trying to accomplish all these these things like that are fucking beautiful shootout, you know right we're, we're but like in... collectively we're we're all like kind of just neutered to do anything we're all effectively like, like right as long around. as we can keep like... spreading information to the people who will receive it i feel like i'm doing what i have to do you know what i mean like i that's i want to at least put that across just like you know what i mean like maybe think about shit a little different than you normally would because this weird beardo, beardo guy sang a fucking song to you or whatever. You know what I mean? It's so, it's as simple as that. Sorry. <laughs> <Steven>. <laughs> so there's, there's a reason why third parties don't work. Uh-huh. Again, what we've been talking about, the behavior or whatnot, that's one thing. And, and it's because the attention that people pay to third parties is minute. You don't know the players. You don't know the process. You don't know all these different pieces of the puzzle, who's running it, how it operates, and, and, and how, 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 how narrative works. Everybody right. knows who the Green Party is. Who's it's painting no who? Secret. Yeah. It, the, why isn't people – why aren't people voting? And why do people keep leaving? But see, that's something that never is never asked because what happens is you have people like Jill Stein that, that still goes and sells the party. You still yeah. have people that Howie Hawkins that, that promote promote things, and and people don't like to hear certain certain things. And th- that was one of the things during, and I, I won't get in, obviously, uh, but running is me yeah. trying to explain all the dirt and shit that's going on. I, sure. I, I'm the bad guy. I'm always yeah. the bad. You know what I mean? So yeah, that's awful. I, I don't have the I don't have the name recognition. I don't have the the, the the experience or whatnot, but I sure as fuck know people, and I, I I know when 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 someone's ignoring a rule and allowing someone else to have these certain resources, and they're using that rule to keep other candidates off ballots. Sure, other, you see what I'm saying? So yeah, absolutely. I, I, it, it, so this one's when I was talking about the thing. It just the vantage point blew my mind because right. everybody tells me go and run, run for president, or they say run run for office, run for office. You run for president. Whoa, whoa, why are you running? What go run for something smaller? It it blew my mind. And then I started getting into it, and you start realizing, of course, it's about the money. The presidential race is the time that most people pay attention. It's when they invest the most money, the most time, and it is what is keeping people, you know, at bay. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Uh, and the down ballot races, all those things are important, but the thing, the the powerful thing about the presidential is the pulpit and they don't want to put anybody on that pulpit that 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 is reasonable at all right because they don't <laughs> want you to say okay wait a second uh, if you're not a fucking team player you're not going on there you're that's you, not you don't think you. that you don't think that you could get a bunch of votes by by prosecuting these people for their war crimes you don't think that that why why do you care if you if if you say here here's a platform here's a place for people to have these discussions and you give them the facts and you give them a format i thought about a debate too like some people like to cuss and yell and scream there should mm-hmm. be a debate format that yeah. allows that you have your moderator Absolutely. you should say like fucking lully, dude because motherfuckers some people like to cuss and yell and scream yes. but they're, not, they're not they're not being um violent 
that's that as I, real as that's as real as yeah. anything that's ever occurred beforehand. Okay, well, like I that's rather nobody somebody. has been any more fucking real than calling someone a motherfucker or whatever to their face. You know what I mean? That's that's fucking real. We that's a human the thing. Truth. We need the we need, real. We like, need fucking truth fuck in people's faces. Society. We, don't we don't have time for that shit. We I don't have I really time feel for like fucking society anymore. I really feel like the ideas. You know that you're that you're you're explaining how how the thing works, how it's just spread out into this popularity contest of fucking bullshit. And if as long as you have enough people on your team, you're gonna fucking win. And that's it. That's well, the you, fucking goal. You want people yeah. to participate and and be engaged. See, the thing yeah. is, is the way they the way that they do it is to make you care enough about the democracy. Democratic Party that you talk about these people as much as you do. Now, it's important to talk about it because you have to say, okay, this is what's going on because they're in sure. power. But there has to be a shift at some point to where you put attention, a lot of attention on the problems of the third party, of the right. problems. And it's it's not to, to, to it, it, people need to be able to, to, to get the shit beat out of them I mean, everything about you from the way you look, because some people aren't yeah. going to like you. Some people think you're too soft. Some people say, right. you know, like, there's a thousand things. And you need to be able to accept that and understand that you represent not just this pocket of people. You represent everybody. It's really there. hard for a lot of people in positions that afford them the ability to analyze those situations that you're talking about right now. Right. There's a lot of fucking pretension and a lot of bullshit that allows people that should have no fucking ability at deciding those things or weighing the relevance of any of those things. Right. But those things are constantly at play. I mean, so at this point, I, I understand that. And I and I agree. You have to have fucking champions for one side. If you hope to fucking crush the other side, that's just how the fuck it's it, it's. You know what I mean? There's two sides, and that's it. And I, if you if you if you go against that, you're the third party, and you're just you're just outside looking in. You're just like well, you're just like a fucking you're a joke hippie on the fucking on the straw man fucking calendar out there. Like, well, they, they don't take you seriously. Okay, maybe what well, maybe the approach that we need to have is that we need to be more like Chad, and we all need to run. Mm. What would happen? I like that. I what like, would happen I, if we like all were the, like, uh, it's such a mockery that we feel like we could all well, do this. And everyone can I just say could, I did the hat. And everybody just like, like puts a bin in. <laughs> what do we got to do? You know what I mean? Like, like, what is it? Like, I don't real, I don't want to, well, I, don't, so, I really well, don't want to, but right. it's, it's, it's kind of like a, the point of it. You know what I mean? Like if they had to show, like if everyone just like, we got, just thousands of people that were just like, nope, I'm gonna run. I'm running 2024. Yeah, fuck you. Lucky 2024. Yeah, bitches. See you 2024. Wait, like, so what's, no. what state do you live in? Connecticut. Connecticut. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, so, well, let me let me let me say this. So, what you're saying is exactly right, and and this this is what the day and age we're in, right? So this this is the important thing. Is that all these organizations? All of these uh, parties, everything, uh, movements have a shelf life because you know that they infiltrate, they come in, they bring people in, they sabotage, all that stuff. So the sure. idea is to know the knowledge of how to, to operate, right? H how, how the political machine works. Because mm -hmm. there, even though we know all these mechanisms are in place to prevent people from getting in office, that we have we have to be able to, of course, be loud enough. Social media is a big a big part of that. A, uh, but we we need to know the, the the process, and it needs to it needs to be available, like you said, for people to to run easy. So, right. in in light of all that went down with with the GPUs, so let me just let me because I I this is this is what I think we have to acknowledge it, it can't be just that, that we can't just vote. This the the point about voting is it, it, it's the principle. That that's what we're supposed to do, even if it's broken. It's, mm -hmm. it's the principle, and also that you're operating a legal arm of it, right? So we can always challenge it. One thing you never hear people about is really law challenging. Uh, you don't hear about that for some reason. No, it, people it, don't challenge shit. 
and that's what the party should when it comes to that. No, they like way. they're soft about it. It's like so. Soft. I mean, you guys yeah. know about Law Tube, right? The Law Tube yeah. guy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, like so point point. What I'm saying is, so in, in light of what they've done, is that we're, we've started a new national party that we're organizing right now. So the Green Party originally started in Germany, Petra Kelly, and then they had an, a, a meeting. A bunch of organizations had a meeting, and then it, that turned into the GPUSA, which was non-electoral. And that was how Howie Hawkins thing. He, he doesn't believe in electoral politics. So when when in, they didn't nominate Nader in 96 or whatever, that's when the GPUS came about because they nominated no one. So, so Hawkins wasn't even invited to GPUS. So he's basically <laughs> sabotaging all these different things. So anyway, so the point is the GPUS is, 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 has been taken over. It's done with. So we do a new national party. And what the, what the party is supposed to be is a federation. So you have this national party that unifies all these state parties. Each state party has its own, its own, this is the process, this is how it works. And we need to make it easy, available for anybody to create a party. Because the idea is to apply pressure at all these different points and all these different ways to where it overloads their system. That's right. the key. So that makes sense. That's, that's what we're doing is we, we've, we've, we're creating this new national party. We've already got certain states because the GPUS has been expelling states because like, you know, Alaska, they actually put Jesse Ventura on the ballot and yeah, and Cynthia, yeah they Cynthia did McKinney VP um, in light of everything that, that went down. Um, and so, so if, if you want to run, you know, then let's, let's go. Cause, cause that's, no, that's I don't really want to run. That's, that's <laughs> like, <laughs> no, I don't really want to. I just like, you know, it's kind of like my own, like, just I love making the, a mockery I love the fact out that of it. Though, there's a, there's know? the thing, the vehicle <laughs> to be able to move forward. If you really are passionate about fucking doing something, then fucking do it. Yeah. Right. I mean, yeah, essentially, that's what you're saying. Yeah. Well, well, but it's it's about saying how how easy it should be for us to to apply pressure because right. a lot of times it's not even about it's not even about spending a lot of time. So, so I was doing mainly virtual stuff. I, I raised two hundred bucks, three hundred bucks for the whole thing. And if one, if if you look at at the whole the whole Green Party primary. You'll see how much hell I raise and how they've been trying to completely erase me. They didn't even give me my half delegate that I got from Tennessee. My <laughs> oh no! I, mean, I, I got the email, and then he emailed me he's like, "Oh, sorry, we didn't give you your half delegate." But, but that was the whole purpose. They wanted to erase me out of it because of the, the shit that I that I started. Um, so it's it's. Um, it, uh, it, politics is a sordid business, my friend. It's it, 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 it's crazy. <laughs> it, so that's what's taken me a long time because my my frustration is it's okay. Well, we have the same we have the same goals that I think people have. We sure. Have the same sense of we want a change the structure, have a sense of community, people having more access. Well, we we have that here in our phones. We sure. in, in a way an app, and it sounds so cliche. But the idea is is the crowdsourcing and how we can say, here's the way we connect. Here's how we can get out of that system and make them obsolete. And it really is. It really is about how those demographics are applied, like how how you use those logistics to your benefit and make the thing that you're doing, you know, capitalize on all of those aspects that are just like waiting to be fucking utilized we need you know? to make the mutual aid network yeah we need to make our Ooh. own underground mutual aid bartering system network like a thing where that people is, can purchase things where we're and, like we're like know? no we're not we're not part of your system we're not doing it's, that it's really hard we're to going back to barter to separate. We're going back to how you know people traded why do we have to use your form of trade why do oh. i have to pay taxes in order to live in a house you know like why why do i you know if 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 i'm gonna if i'm gonna pay taxes somewhere then i want it to you know i want it to actually go to something within that's gonna benefit like you know 
people within like you know like my area my town but, okay peaches chill come here chill chill why are you so keyed up I, that's that's me that's me it's my energy okay there we go all right yes we better now all right no but, what I, what yeah. I was saying is you know i only spent uh, so i only like it was like only like 250 bucks something like that and part of the uh, of one of the things that they they their requirements to get this special uh this spe it's supposed to be for special lists and special things right it wasn't supposed to prevent somebody from speaking in front of, of the party to say okay hey here's your option um but the internet can be so much can can be done with it and there were so, a few different times in the in that primary where they were backed into a corner and and that they showed their ass and that we have all this documentation and and what jimmy Dore did with force the vote i thought the model was you know similar which is something that we need to 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 figure out and, and work on because what what had happened oh my was, gosh did you see the i did a i i went on to joe fire i went and talked to joe firestone about force the vote and all this <laughs> and like uh -uh. Our, our state of the our politics and um he tried to censor me like on a live stream and tried to freaking kick me off a live stream just yeah. because he didn't like what i was saying and uh i called him out on it i called him out on his censorship like right then <laughs> and there on the live stream it's it it's like savvy savvy saw it in uh like later on i didn't even show it to her and and she was she was quite impressed i'm impressed i was impressed with myself well, with so when it came to, to like force the vote i was like it's not even about jimmy door it's well i'm it's like the you're model missing of, the point yeah, you know I'll, like it's not about jimmy I mean, door yeah and franco had said the great unmasking which i thought was the bigger takeaway them yeah. not even trying showed more about their uh, their willing their their unwilling to do anything yeah. than, yeah. than if if they actually kind of pretended in a different way does that make sense that so yeah no, no. that Definitely. that was the model i thought was so so powerful is you you take you take a situation where you basically have a gotcha moment to say what are you going oh, it to was do fantastic it here's was your power so here, here's a way to do it and it was and again that didn't cost a damn thing but right jimmy door's influence but it, it showed again where everybody's ass was exactly. and how they tried to flip it and and that's why actually the that's why started, they tried to that's why it was away it's so that. easily seen when it's you know what i mean when everybody's like all right okay we're shining the light over here everybody that's, let's look at this one thing for a second been, everybody should have been on that's that. the thing everybody should have been right on that it should have been a you the, the one thing that you know that that unified everybody that should have been like that solidification yeah. of oh it should my be gosh, like okay we have whatever else go fuck have, yourself we have the we have the we have the yeah. reason we have everybody should be behind this this is like it's it's not even a jimmy door idea you know like it's it's in the dsa like you it's, have like, a winner it's politics him, 101 like you put them what the fuck we have a winner <laughs> what and then everything <laughs> exactly oh my God. Sorry. sorry chad oh, go ahead my ear. No, no. It was it, it 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 was so beautiful because it said here's first of all he said here's what you said you know and, and do it and, and and you don't see that often and right. you don't see such such a a an energy thing and, and a zest for a, applying a thing yes yeah it, it exposed all the and, oh, Kyle and the bread tubers exactly it. gamer oh it was hundreds it was, and hundreds it, of fucking podcasters just like oh it. fuck my my you blew up my fucking spot Shit. it blew up everybody's yes. fucking spot you knew who everybody had to reevaluate. like everybody and, and, was like so exposed why, and like vulnerable so and all had to like 
you know, answer to that, like what they thought of it, because it was such a big thing. It's a, it, it was the biggest controversy of like the politics. It blew the fucking shit out of the water. It is pretty funny how that works. They, they control it was every crazy. so often. The spectrum of conversation and mm. the spectrum of of discussion, the spectrum of 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 solution. So the that's what the thing is, is you can acknowledge the problem, but then, right. then there's no real fix. There's no, because anything you say is so radical. You have to listen to them like, Oh, like anybody pretending that Biden is still with it. it, I know. it, it <laughs> nobody, nobody can have a fucking cohesive opinion about Would anybody Biden. leave their child with that man. Like this man has, no. uh, he's, no. he's the president, but Never. Uh, I you're don't letting care. him drive that truck. Really? Yeah. Like, Oh, what in the fuck? It was, it was it was just insane. Like force the vote was the biggest like but exposure. That, that is really a wonderful thing to think about. Uh just how all of this fucking stuff moves underneath the mainstream, right? This this is the counterculture. This, yes. This there's we, this pop Jimmy Dore and, and I and I, and I hate to say it like that, but what J Jimmy Dore is doing it is so huge. That I don't think people really understand it. No, people I mean, people, people don't do. get that that the numbers is. of it are right. escape like people. Him, I think and like him or not, it doesn't matter if you yeah. like him or not. And that, no. that that is a completely different fucking yeah. thing. No, it's a social phenomenon that's happening. Like yeah, thing that he's the hierarchy of fucking knowledge in the independent media sphere. Like you can only come out. When Jimmy is fucking beaming from the top of the mountain, if you say something fucking six months sooner, he's not going to acknowledge any of it. Well, yeah, he's the, he's, he's the thing with Jimmy. It's, it's hard. Jimmy, it's firing on all cylinders all the time. Yeah. And, and how could you not be? And, and the thing <laughs> with all this information, so much, so much going on, and fuck. he's trying to pick and choose. Pop my and, head off. But, I mean, I and think about the filter that he gets it from, too, right? Like, yeah, I, he's I, get I remind, a hang on, hang on. Here. I remind Steve sometimes uh. that you know, like, okay, we can't put all of it on him as one person. Because can you imagine how many people are behind the scenes? You know, he's got Steph that does stuff, and he's got Mishka, and he's got. You know, he's got everybody doing things and helping to produce. So it's the same kind of concept you have to think about as somebody who only watches mainstream media. Like he's getting funneled that same. Where is his funnel of information coming in? No, he has the information that we want funneled out. That's the fucking problem. The, the main the main focus but, of it is it needs to be turned around on its head. Jimmy Dore has this huge platform. He's a fucking beacon. Shine your fucking light. Well, yeah, that's what I'm saying. And you but know, it puts it, a target on his back. And I know it does. Back. I it's know a, it does. It kills but, every but, one of our fucking well, heroes. Remember, but what the fuck else do you want the guy to do? Remember, but here's the thing. Here's the thing, too. There's a sweet spot, too, in, in what he's doing. And, and uh, there the, is. Again, the, I don't agree with him on everything. No, no, <laughs> I'll I have tell a hard time you. seeing it more well, and more. Well, I, and I don't either. I, I actually. I had an issue with him staying at, at, at TYT for a while. I had, I had issue with him ignoring what was kind of, cause he actually said he ended up voting for Howie Hawkins, even though he, yeah. even though he, he didn't like yeah, to. Yeah, uh, really you know, wishy-washy like, shit. Uh, there was, uh, and there was a couple other things, but again, at the end of the day is clearly uh, it, until you have proof or whatever more, I, 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 it's not about that. Again, I, I think it, it's the idea of, of like what you were saying, somebody that that can kind of uh, get through to people. And and I saw something in the chat. It, it really sets people off on, on the left. They said a uh, principled left, a lightning yeah. rod. A rim mm -hmm. is a lightning rod on the principled left. And and again, yes. it, it it's not about Jimmy Dore worship. It's about seeing how a, a, a personality that is passionate and, 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 and that is trying to get it right, right. Can, can set the establishment on fire. And again, because those are the, the protectors, like your Kyle Kalinske's, your uh, um, all these little things. Yeah, they're little fucking minions, DNC it, minions. It yeah. is, is to say, okay, the counterculture is now 
it, it's just you they have to repeat the establishment in, in a more I get it. They're buffers, way. they're buffers between right. those I mean, those uh, opinions. Kyle Kalinsky was on Vanguard today. I don't know if you guys saw that. It was it was basically it was Bernie Sanders worship. It was it was uh talk about Jimmy Dore. He said he stand by everything that he said. And that see that whole thing with with him, I thought was was a, a very uh, it, it was eye opening too, uh, with with uh, the whole Anna Anna thing. Mm-hmm. He kind of inserted himself in there to try to distance himself from Jimmy Dore. You know, did you know the whole the new skirt, the new skirt saga? <laughs> the new skirt. Okay, she mooned him. Wait a okay? second. <laughs> My opinion of this is not like what mo- like most people. Okay, I think that Anna wore something that was inappropriate. She mooned him, and she tried to use it to her advantage later on that's i think what happened she from a female mean, fucking perspective she mooned him i mean what the fuck he didn't like did did he look under there like did he like yeah, stick his head I, under and go i really oh, feel wait, like jimmy wouldn't be like here? hey look at my ass anna i mean if they were perfectly fine and they had a co- i've been i've Maybe been in that kind of work environment like I had I worked at a freaking I, I worked at you know IHOP, you know Pancake House third shift when Bar oh, Rush would some happen. Kind of racy waitress. Okay, <laughs> like I, I dealt I've dealt with like a number of of well, all kinds of people. Who have I married here? Happened. What the hell is going on? One time a guy saw my thong, right? Because I was bent over in my freaking, it was my clothing, my problem. He saw that I had a red thong on. And he sang the thong song to me every time he came into the restaurant. Inappropriate. It was inappropriate, but it was hilarious. And it was my bra. Like, I didn't fucking, like, I wouldn't go back now later on in life and be like, oh, yeah, well, this guy, he harassed me by singing me the thong song when I worked. But, in the, you know what I mean? Like, when I was 23. You know? But, yeah. But, no, it's uh, not. And, and do you think that that guy meant any malice out of out of that? Of no, not at all. Never, he, was, like, he was a good, he was a good hearted person who came into the restaurant all the time. It was a yeah. different time. Like at that, at that point, you know, say, certain saying certain crude things was, was that's a different time frame. Yeah, man, like this, it's, it's so it crazy to not, think that well, like, it how now, much space there is between now, like, that now would be and not then. safe. That would be so not safe wow. and it would be obscene now and it would be out of line. And then it was like, that's just something that like, that was it's part like of at like, what, what happened. Like, at what it, point did us not having to be buckled in the seat belts in the back seat become the point where we can't make any rational decisions well, any, well, going well, look, forward. Look at it like this. Look at it like this. Some people have have, have like like dirty comedy or dirty jokes, right? Like they're they're dirty. Uh-huh. Some people. So you, say you're you're you date five people, right? Maybe only one of them likes that. So uh-huh. it, it doesn't mean that I there's mean, any malice. It, camel it, toe segment. Those four, those four. How do you people, do that? Sure. Does that make sense? Like. I, I, what I and what I mean is is that is the the problem is I don't and I don't think we talk about is that guys is part of how how we operate is how we see other guys get get women sure part partly and and that's all me, contingent upon that absolutely well, well, you, of course because you're like okay well you're trying you're trying to learn and right good or not you know what I mean those are those are the things that you know you you. You you try to navigate, but you try you I, try to em, emulate those things of well, the people that you see are successful, you know, well, with the with the girls the, that they're trying to talk to. But I mean, to bring something thing. up the years down the road woman, and try basically. to like, but what's you, that? I was saying Sorry. the same thing doesn't work for every woman, right? So that that that's the 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 key the key point is is you know, but you, you look you, back at Anna's like history of what she's, how she's spoken about women and how she's been very disrespectful to females in general and exposing them, literally doing a camel toe segments. Like that just kind of discredits that whole, like now she gets to be like, yeah, I mooned she's, you once in the she, office. Yeah, she, she does not get it was to like accident remove on my herself part, maybe. from that echelon. You know, like, well, like that just, that, that doesn't compute It's like if the me. camel like, toe that fits, hold. I'm sorry. You Ka- know, Ka- Threatened to like he would he said something about punching. He said if somebody said that uh-huh. to my girl, I would punch him in the face or something. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or some and, and a lot of the things that he said, 
is he, he says he doesn't want to he doesn't want to get personal uh what was, was something it, it, you got to listen to what people people say because they're telling you the truth but you just, they're just not you're not applying it right right yeah that's it's generally like, how it always goes it's filtered yep. it's all so, filtered and funneled into it in a certain it's way it's how you perceive it like, is, is mm -hmm. more important than anything else now i'm sure and, that Amber the Heard. way that she could tell that story uh to a girlfriend and the way that it was perceived you know very publicly like i'm going to use this now against you later on is completely different like it backfired. He called her bluff. He called it out. He's like, all right, well, here's the fucking truth. Here's the truth of what matter, what happened. Like, let me just get in front of this and be honest about it. And that's what, that's why I take what he said with like with more, uh, you know, with emphasis of, of believability because it makes sense. It's logical. It's not something that he's probably like, you know, was like, yeah, let me, you know, let me bring this up to embarrass you or something. You know, like it's not something that he would necessarily benefit from bringing up and exposing either, you know, like. Right. You know, and, and that's the thing is everybody has a different focus, a different passion as far as. And we just talking about Jimmy, right? Like yeah. Yeah, and and that's you know his his what he focuses on obviously is is the the corruption basically and how how all these things operate how the, the media lies the propaganda uh, the oh wars, yeah because he was like calling them out he was calling out their you know the fact that they get they get cats and bird money and like all this other shit like it's, it completely distracted and it it served its purpose it's the now the what was the real thing that Jimmy was calling out is 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 put behind this whole like front of i'm worried about how anna felt that many years ago when she did this thing and she well, wore something inappropriate well, he you sent know? an apology he sent her a card because he said it embarrassed her like that's yeah. the thing is like certain times you hear people joke you people say shit like oh okay and, and that and honestly that that clearly everybody was seeing it Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah, he just said the that obvious legitimizes action. the thing, though, right there, the Chad. It's like I, like he said I the sent truth. you a card to say, you know, I, no big deal. It's just, you know, it's just a fucking goof or whatever because like, he cared enough to fucking do that. So that, to me, just kind of takes away from any sort of like harsh vibe that Anna was trying to portray him with in this way because it just seemed saying... like he was just being a friend who would. The, the, the and I don't agree with Jimmy on I everything. Would, I would probably. I don't agree. I will sit here similar. and, and yell at See, the freaking at the at the computer, going, "Oh my god, Jimmy, you're totally missing it. You're totally missing it." Oh yeah, it. no, we you do know? that constantly. I I can't even fucking listen uh, to the show half the fucking time because oh, I'm gets, just like Steve I, gets so mad. I tune it out. I'm 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 listening to people like uh you know renovate old cars and shit that haven't run in like, thirty he'll years. He'll have the ear. He'll have the earbuds that it's more satisfying. Half here. My hear me listening to jimmy the, uh, door and he gets so mad <laughs> and sometimes i get really jimmy door and kurt going yeah, back and forth i I, I, love, I love team kurt i I'm, lost it i'm sorry you guys i kurt, i try to be a fan i want to have kurt and you know? Rick on uh, at the same time uh, like i really want to <laughs> make that happen yeah. tell him chad i feel i, I want to be a fan but i just can't you know here, can't here's the, commit the way the, i used to it, my, my my position now jimmy <laughs> it is I, I I like I like Jimmy. I, he's a comedian, and yep. and, and I and yep. I think that's that the struggle we were talking about that line, and is, that's where is, he is is he's not having to take yourself too seriously because right. here's the thing is 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 the, the the toll that it takes on you to be it, it, to to know what's going on. You're going to be angry. This mm -hmm. is if you really understand what's going on and you really right. think about it, you, you already know it makes you angry. These are legitimate fucking anger feelings. These are real angsts that you're feeling. <laughs> yes. I, I, I look, I'm, I look at it as trying to navigate. Cause I, I don't, I don't look at it as him any malice from, you know, no. and I, I think if, if that were ever the case or whatnot, I, I think, I, I mean, I don't, but the, the point is, is, is we have to understand like the issues and the situations 
and the principles of what we see like again like how forced to vote it's not about jimmy it's about somebody that actually used their platform put somebody on the spot and then made aware that right. hey, wait a second, you had the chance to do something and you didn't that's right. the kind of thing is or, or somebody that's they're telling you everything that's going on because it becomes blatantly uh, I mean, obvious to everyone around them like you have to do these blame, things yeah and they're mad i mean mm -hmm. for me that was one of the reasons too it was like okay because when i ran is I ran, I ran custom motherfuckers out and, and I ran yeah. like the whole time. Cause that was, that's yeah. the whole thing is like, this is the, you don't like my language. I, I don't care. There's a lot of people that talk like this, you know, yes. this, but people want this caricature of a politician that, right. that feels safe, that, that speaks the, the script that yep. does all these different things rather than saying, Hey, are that wears really the gonna, fucking Brooks uh, Brothers and and and, and looks this? the part. Uh, do you and, and it's the same thing as a lot of people don't want to work. And, and I, I I don't knock anybody that doesn't want to work for themselves, you know, or, or do, that wants to. No work man, for fuck that. Everybody I, work for themselves. Fuck yeah. Well, I, I, well, Everybody thing, deserves a come up. <laughs> That's my point. Well, <laughs> my, my thing is, I, I look at it as in not everybody wants to deal with with running a business. No, because. You see what I'm saying? So, but if you do, I, I, that's I, what I'm I, saying. I, everybody I, I who who endeavors, honest. everyone who endeavors to try, then fucking God bless him. Everybody people fucking try. Operate it. If you get okay, let's yeah. say if you give somebody the, the, the tools, the, the the space to do something, sometimes they do more and work harder at, at getting paid as an employee. So that that's one of the things that. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? That's a re no, know. that's a reality. I I, right. I understand right. that with that sure uh, um just because just dealing with dealing with trying to i mean I, 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 there's an old house that i've been trying to rehab and i was trying to get people from the town and they have a business or whatnot and my thing is it's the whole all about marketing it's all about organizing it and and, and doing a branding right right and especially when it comes to content that's it's something you know it's you can make content out of it. Sure. Um, but you, I couldn't get people to move like a, as a partner in a way, you know what I mean? A, even with me still kind of paying it, right. it, it, it created, uh, again, some people they're not interested and maybe that's the thing is, is maybe they're not interested in running a business in that field or that profession that, that, you, you know, cause that's what, for me, I'm, I'm like trying to help. And right. that manner, like, how can I help? How can I be involved in this? Because that, that's that's how I feel. Because I, I feel like we have to go with with the co-op model, right? The Ocean's mm -hmm. Eleven yeah. model. Every, everybody, okay, in, in order to, to, to put this product out or to run this business, we need this set set of people, right? So, you know, you you create the, the, that that business, whatever, based upon like a co-op kind of thing. Everybody do, does yeah. their position to, to get their pot and, and, and then right. based we, upon the needs of the community and whatever. Yeah. And, and I mean, there should be, there should be a fucking app. There should be an app where you go in and say, okay, well, I live in this County. Okay. Here's all the people running. Here's, you should be able to, to see everything. You yes. know, who, 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 who are the people that they appoint? What, what positions do they appoint? You know, right. who, who, who are they re related to? Who works you know, for the sheriff's department? Who, yeah, all of those all things. All that stuff. Yes. And, and we need transparency. Who's the town clerk? How do I get a fucking permit? You know, like, and all of these things are and, and are questions online. for anybody in a town. All that information is online. It just sure. I don't feel like anybody has organized it to, to right. and, and that, that's something I see what you're saying. that I I want to bring into the party again. It it the idea is to bring value. And to say, yeah. okay, well, here's the way to do it. Because, because, in one day, right? So, the the idea is is to show how you can apply pressure to the system without having without having to maneuver too much, right? To not have to leave your house. What's what's going to be the easiest on my life to make the establishment do what the establishment needs to do, right? And first thing we need to recognize. Mm -hmm. Is that they're capable of whatever they need to do to keep you to keep people in check and they've got all these things in line and in, in, in place and and 
this this is not this is they a have serious, lots of systems to stop you from <laughs> this is serious serious problem you know yes um I don't see it. It's so serious that I, I forgot where I was going with it. <laughs> uh, no, that's awesome. Like, I understand you, what you're, you're saying, though. You're bringing all the connectivity you're breaking, together, You're breaking though. the connectivity oh, yeah. down Yeah, right, right. for like, the people. How it's easy. It makes it easier for people so you can, you know, it's you can see. Crowd, like Crowdsource. Yeah. Like, okay, so Johnny Depp, I was telling people, like, the left, if the left, if the left were really fucking serious about doing something, it, it would... It, it would have focused on the motherfucking Johnny Depp trial because what the Johnny Depp trial did was reveal not just it revealed the ACLU and how they basically <laughs> used it, weaponized the Me Too movement. It, it, it involved, you know, fucking uh, Elon, uh, fucking yeah, all these different you know, people. Amber Hurt's team is yeah. how you had all these clinical people, all these people that have all these professions, all these different accolades, and you see them going around speaking and, and doing these things, and they're sitting there lying, and they're sitting there painting a, a picture, and they're able to be bought on yeah. the stand to ignore yes. certain information. So again, the, the, the what was revealed, and, and there was so many hours. So I, I watched it through LawTube, yeah. and it blew my mind because we need to approach this from a lawyer's perspective because all these people are lawyers and all these people speak in legal ease. Right. All these things are done with this mindset. And mm -hmm. I feel like, I feel like, there needs to be there needs to be a fucking powerhouse of attorneys yeah, on every dude. motherfucking team. And Chad, that's, that's I feel like I feel like for real, dude. Every time I have this kind of conversation with somebody, I feel like I'm like, you know, just a just a hundred law books behind the smartest motherfucker who should be heading this kind of thing up. You know what I mean? Like who should be like, yeah, motherfucker, let's go. You know, all of you guys need to get behind this idea because it's so important. That everybody understand it you know it's it's really i don't know i just i feel like a fucking uh well so like it's so just the, an innocent bystander in the whole fucking so, mess of it like what the fuck so like, everything that's going on in jimmy Dore's realm right when you see the cow kalinsky's right this this is this this is the the political left right that we're, we're paying attention to and, and these pockets you see how it works with all these different it's He's just said, like watching celebrity yeah. fucking yeah. drama yeah. bullshit. Well, I'm like, I don't have fucking time for this. You see the, the levels of people because they interact. Well, uh -huh. that same system is working in this law tube system where all these lawyers are working together, young, and, and they're they're basically communicating and they're building this network. And during the Rittenhouse trial, is they raised a bunch of money. Some of the, some of these because people were viewing it through their their channels. Their the lenses. Gap, one guy made a hundred and something thousand in super chats through the trial. Yeah, yeah dude. Some other people made they For made real. hundreds of thousands of dollars. But but the, the the point is, and and even some of those lawyers actually went and sat in the trial. So as we're watching, you're hearing from lawyers' perspective on all these different things, how they frame it, and and yep. you see the the language, the hearsay, and you it, it it smarter people than me, basically that can go in and and, and connect these dots. You know right. what I mean? Be well, that's the thing. That's the thing that I see that that's happened in the last like you know twenty years or thirty years, maybe solid, right? Every there's 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 an echelon of people that are privy to information that all the rest of the people are just like shown on a screen like oh there it goes you know what I mean like oh you missed that sorry you know what I mean like just this constant barrage of fucking information that's coming and there's levels of people you know levels thick from us that are fucking you know encapsulating all of this information and learning all of our fucking biorhythmic fucking algorithms and all the things and the ways that we decide to act on a certain political fucking, you know, motive or, or whatever, you know what I mean? Whatever the result is, they played out every single fucking scenario that we could ever think up. And they're just, they're just playing them out as they go. You know what I mean? They're just dueling out the fucking chips yeah, as they fucking lie. And you know, humanity's uh, yeah. just fucking along for the ride. Uh, see, that's, that's the thing is I think, I think that's what it feels like anyway. Maybe I'm fucking could, way off. If you we know? could all focus on the one thing, 
Like the I, one I, thing, and all of us could just wrap our head around the same okay, one so, thing that could unite us. Then I that's, and then, um, there's so much drama. Like we need, we need to use like what, like the like you're saying the law to. We need to like sit, take what they're what doing. Was, what what were you uh, thinking right there, and Chad? Do that. You just you seem like you're about to. No, because it was something that I talked about. I was trying to remember exactly what I said. It's um, it's corruption, um, election integrity, and propaganda. Mm -hmm. I feel like those three issues. And the thing is, it, 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 it's so wild that anybody, and we won't talk about anything like that, just in general, you know, right. don't feel... You know, we got to push for an open source, verifiable thing. That's it, basically. We have, we, yeah. and and again, we need we, to we figure out our spider web, like <laughs> yeah. those yeah. lawyers are figuring out. Yes. We need to connect now the people that are awake in all these micro spheres, right? Like we have all these like different circles, and they kind of all like overlap just a little bit. That's what it feels like to me. Is like mycology how mycology looks we on need a map. to we need to kind of like That's say kind of okay our circles are overlapping here and we uh, to, uh we need to, we need to we need we need we need some brilliant people who can figure out an entire guys. like way to network all of us together so that i know the people in my area that are like the law to people like you know what i mean like i, I can i can look up like my area and and try to find like the mutual aid and that building that network and that and is true on omar, the ground network where we can kind of network within our networks omar you know? says find something to unite on and momentum will surely follow yeah i that's know that's absolutely. what what is the one thing that we can unite everybody on though uh, i'm I, see see the thing is it's 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 not about the issue as much as it is is about who we look to to lead that that's that's the problem is because it, it is the issue gets muddy when we put our faith or, or people pick and choose the politician that they want so it's like the bernie sanders thing is it's the issue is is done because it can't be one person yeah well well no it's not about just being i, I mean i i agree i agree with that but it can't but, be one that that's the thing it needs well, to be like okay, a tribunal of people yeah. that are really like yeah. collectively the, point is, is the people that people pay attention to and that are engaged with the hollywood thing uh -huh. your aoc the squad marianne williamson bernie sanders so the, these are the front lines of of the gatekeepers because they keep you engaged and entertained and still yeah. even having the conversation oh you know what they are they're the they're the they're the, 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 they're the light the, Chad, they're the light bright pieces on the board. You know what I mean? Those are the pieces that stay lit up when you're when you're making other things happen on your on your light well, bright. That's they want you to participate in, right. in, in just in, in, in just in the gossip of it, just in in, in, in the drama of it. And, yep. and and I hate to say drama because I don't want to minimize no what's going on because because that's actually that's an accurate portrayal of what it is because it, it is just human drama fucking of various fucking descriptions but, but you ignore it, it's a corporation you're not yeah. going if you're a burger flipper at mcdonald's nothing I, i'm not condemning anybody you're not going to change the model of the type of burgers you get because you're a burger flipper right so, so the, the democratic party is a corporation it's it, it's made up you're not going to change it so operating underneath it is only putting energy, dollars, and effort to make people still think, okay, well, I'm going to try it here. And and it's it's this is democratic, democratic, you know, yeah. and they raise like that's our 80 fucking, fucking that's our million dollars. Man. We are just like from programmed. RV Wade, 80 million? 80 million in fucking two weeks, bro. They, they, they literally well, they it's, did, they it's did, been two you know, fucking weeks. They did they leak it and give everyone, you know, dollars. They, they leaked it and let gave, gave everyone about 30 days or I know, so. But of they a, literally of a head start. 80 you know, million dollars. They so everybody could get vacation much. time off. 
Imagine if we did that for mutual <laughs> aid protest. for instead. Uh, why are we put? We need to. We need to put our system. We need to put it out towards aggravated. Like, you know, this guy is smart. He is like smart. tour for the poor, like what Rome is doing. Properly, I think. That like if we put what <laughs> imagine if we could like if people really put the money towards something that was actually good, like like yeah, you know, if you want good and like we need to have a mutual we need to have a system of people, but we have to be able to trust them. Yeah, and that, that's the thing is that like people if you can stay engaged, put, if you can stay engaged with those people in your area that you're entrusting to do the things that you need them to do, then it's functioning the way that it's supposed to. The second you step away from that and allow some, Hey, this is my buddy, Joe. He'll take care of the shit down there at the fucking city hall. Don't worry about that. You, that's, that's your problem. You know what I mean? It just like manifests from there. I I think so. Okay. So the, the it's a way, the, the way the money's moved around, right? Clearly, it's how, how we spend our money. It, we've, we've got to move our money as a block. And then that way, yeah. it, it, it messes up our system. But the thing is, you still, you still have to understand, you know, the 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 fallout from certain things. Because there there is there is yeah. a, a shift. But we but the thing is, is, is being aware and, and under understanding that. So and I, plus, I, there's the, the highways that you're using to do these things are already, like, predestined to fucking you know, reap their results, not yours. So it's, right. it's well, a fight it, the whole time. So they, they've got, so they've got all, okay. I think the idea is to invest into the rural area, right? I think that there needs to be a model of like renewing, like renovating and, and using renewable material mm -hmm. and, and rebuilding all of these houses and, and, and having some sort of farm freeze to where these farms stay open and, and that they can be managed by a co-op right. through the estate. And this, this is something, cause I, I, I so do the agro can, can benefit the, the community, the community, right. because right. what's happening is cause I work, I work in, in, in title real estate. I do, I do title searches. So when I do, I do a lot of, of green belt properties, a lot of farmland and it mm -hmm. gets sold off and everything gets built up and stuff, you know, and people are pushing out of the city. And, 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 you know, the rural areas are starting to, you know, to, to, you know, turn into up. little towns. Yeah. Right. Well, I mean, but the thing is they, a lot of these have been towns, they just have been run down. And, and right. so what I want to do is, is to focus energy on rebuilding these towns and, and, and taking the, the, um, the, uh, the the culture of the town and taking the the nuance and not the nuance the the um, you know the, the vibe the charm of its own the city sure. and just and rebuild and a lot of towns culture is a good term you know um, the culture of the town sure so, so that way it's easier for people to but the thing is is at that same time as we you know and understand how to how to grow these communities and how to grow these certain things to to a safe level to where we're, we're able to spread it spread out because I, I think we need to have people more in in, in the rural area there's so many old I houses think what, so many places i mean absolutely. flip michigan something like you houses for two thousand i mean i know that shit's fucked up but the point is 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 it, it the, we we can inspire people to do certain things yeah, like and shit like that they're getting paid big bucks to do you know certain crazy shit you know I mean? We can we can rejuvenate things that have fallen by the wayside that people if people would just invest in their communities specifically, well, so, so it, it, it seems our, like it just kind of happens. Imagine if our military wasn't anyway. off doing all what it's doing to wreak havoc all yeah, over the world. If it was and actually it, they were actually our you know the people were actually here and it ran as a as an actual a, a positive system collective. where you know like we are a collective people and stop being so like we need to come back to the community to you know to to bring ourselves back together at a at a more of a grassroots level within our own communities i think that there's so many of us and so many people are scattered and then people also are more likely to join something than start something. 
I think that that's something that, that I've noticed that, you know, it's a lot to take something on, but if we all kind of can, can work together and carry a burden together, then we can make the connections within our community just like the the law two people are doing and other you know we just we need to figure out the way to to kind of like get everybody to just kind of draw back from this cycle that they're stuck in like they're stuck in a cycle we're going to continue doing this same exact thing and talking about the same things and repeating the same things over and over again until it finally somebody stops that cycle and we break it and we say, all right, we're all going to focus on this. Let's go. Like we need to get together. We, we don't have time for this. I want to, th I want to thank uh, Chad for hanging out with us and uh, everybody who hung out with us so late tonight. Thank you very much. And uh, it's been a fucking awesome conversation. This is awesome. We shall Thank continue you. it. For Chad, sure. please email us. We'd love to uh, keep in touch and, you know, uh, tell people where to find you and shit. Because, uh, um, well, I, I, I um, kind of yell and scream on Twitter right now. Mostly it's Chad Wilson 2020, but that's. Um, I, I haven't really been, I mean, that's it, kind of where I've been most active, but, uh, I haven't, uh, I've got different pages and different things that I'm working on uh, that I'll be sharing at some point. And awesome. I do music, I do music and I'm going to be, uh, releasing some new stuff too. Sweet. That's awesome. Chad, we should jam, man. Yeah. That's I, I, so awesome. You know? I, I, I should send you a link. You guys can hear some music if you want. Fuck. Yeah. That's Focus awesome. Up. I love it because I think I don't even know. I think we might have seen each other in like Beauty and the Boomer chat, I think, before. Oh, definitely. Mm -hmm. And Years um, ago. like in yeah. you know, probably in Jimmy Doors, but it's like it goes so fast. Now they're chats and stuff, but it's so cool to have you come on screen and like talk with us. We love that. We love uh, that. Like, you stuff. know, we're we really <laughs> feel the way that we feel. Like we're we're genuine when we say what we're saying to people. We really yeah. want everyone to come together and, and, and like, it's just, it's awesome when, when it works that way. Keep it real people. Me too. We love you. Thanks for All hanging right. out with us. Well, thank you so much, you guys. I appreciate you. you yeah. Too, well, you got to come back on and uh, have some more talks with, with me too on, uh, on uh, my show. Yeah, man. All right, you guys, uh, we'll see you next time. Thank you We're gonna all for more, tuning though. in. We're going to ne keep networking and, We're gonna network keep and building this. We're going to because... network our networks together. Yeah, we're going to network our networks. Are you fucking kidding me? We're going to network those <laughs> networks that <laughs> we had networked it, together we, you know, and network them together. All what? of our loop, all of our bubbles. We're going to loop over, all our loops together you know? and it's going to be loopy. We're going to loop all the loops together and it's going to be loopy. Loop all the loops together. Loops it's together loop all loop. Loop all the loops together. Loop it's together loop all loop. Loop, 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 loop all the loops together. Loop it's together loop all loop. loop, 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 loop oh my gosh. <laughs> all right. Thanks for listening, everybody. It's been fun. Uh, oh, Steve is tired. I'm Steve just I'm suddenly not really like tired. I'm just kind of spun and uh it's it's time to go watch some goofy shit on TV, I guess. It was excellent listening to Chad um talk about smart stuff for a while there. Chad, that was awesome. Yeah. What Thank you for sharing great, with us, buddy. Great dive. Like, let's, uh, let's, uh, let's like intentionally try to jam together at some point or, uh, you know, send me some music so I can jam with it. And then, uh, I don't know. Let's do some shit because I love to play music and I love to play music with, uh, cool people. And Chad Wilson is a cool people. Yeah. That was awesome. So, uh, all you people that don't know, make sure you go know. All right. Yeah, everyone, go subscribe over to uh, Chad's YouTube. Chad, you're gonna have to come back on. Yeah. You know, uh, that was a, that was a cool. Deal. Like hey, organic. Baby. It's, 
All right, yeah. ladies and gentlemen, uh, this is the end of the stream. It's officially the end of the stream. This is the end of the stream part right here. If uh, if you're not sure when the end of the stream it is, it's right now. It's almost at the end right now. If you listen closely, you'll hear the end <laughs> now. It's, it's right now. It's almost at the end right now. If you listen closely, oh you'll God. hear the end now. It is. It's right now. It's, it's almost the at end, end of the right stream. Oh, my gosh. Closely, it's showing you, like, the on and off now. the screen. It's, right it's the now. end it's of the stream. The listen closely, you'll hear all right we love you guys peace out girl scouts